Man, how y'all feeling? It's AC Lucky back with another video. I'm not gonna lie, bruh. This is a legendary bathroom, you feel me? Like, if you go look back at my channel, like, I started in here, you feel me? Like, I ain't gonna never forget this, you feel me? And I feel like loving yourself is not easy when you're a person that's not used to loving yourself, you feel me? It's not easy as it seems, but that don't mean that you can't love yourself. You gotta be comfortable in that feeling of feeling uncomfortable. That feeling when you feel like, oh, like I don't know what's going on with me. I don't know what's happened to me. That feeling is a blessing in disguise. That feeling you feel when you feel like you don't know what's happening to you. You are growing so fast. You are outgrowing the old version of you. You feel me? And it's like, Everything is like a perspective. So like once you really change your perspective on your situation It's like that's when the ideas start to flow And the word no is very powerful like once you begin to really start to say no It's like you see how people treat you Like no is a part of loving yourself Sitting in that uncomfortable feeling is a part of loving yourself So don't make things hard on yourself because at the end of the day, you still a you still a a, a a a soul. You still a spirit and soul. You still a human being. What they call us type shit. You feel me? So it's like take your time. I'm saying take your time when it comes to projects. Take your time when it comes to meeting people. Cause we really don't know what we want until we really get to know ourselves. You don't really know what you want out of a relationship until you really get to know yourself. Like, you don't really know what you want out of a person when you don't know yourself. So it's like, spending time yourself, like, really spending time with yourself should be valued. You got to value that time with yourself because it's going to be times where you just around a bunch of different personalities and you got to you gotta know how to deal with that. You got to know how to avoid certain situations and people because us as spirits and souls we travel without knowing we are traveling so when you wake up you feel like oh today gonna be a bad day you gotta change that you gotta change your perspective when you wake up feeling like you wanna you woke up on the wrong side of the bed just change your perspective okay even though i feel this feeling i still gotta try my best at that Every single day is really a day to learn something new about yourself. Like, even when you don't know what's happening in your life, you still got to appreciate where you at in life. You got to appreciate your struggle. A lot of people, they don't really accept their struggle. You got to accept your struggle. You got to accept, like, okay, I can really make shit happen, you feel me? Like, when I started making videos in the bathroom, I had a big ass imagination, like millions and hundreds and like billions of kids watching my videos. I'm inspired billions of kids because they can, can they can connect with me. When they sit in the bathroom on their phone watching AC Lucky, they gonna get an idea that they can do the same thing. I'm connecting with people by just embracing my struggle. So embracing your struggle is a part of loving yourself. When you when you embrace your struggle, embrace where you are at in life, it's like you will elevate so fast that people are going to question like where do you come from? Like where did this person come from? Like what planet is this person from? Like people want to get to know you. So when people want to get to know you, just use your intuition. Because it's going to be people that come out the blue. It's going to be people that really come out the blue. Like people from your past. Like people that you didn't know fuck with you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it'd, be, it'd be so surprising how this internet shit work. Like, it'd be people from Africa, London, all around the world. And it's like they can relate to you. So it's like, how can I 
express myself to the world? That's the question all people should ask themselves. How can I express myself to the world? Because when you start to express yourself to the world, you allow other people to express themselves to the world and you. You want to meet a person that come up to you like, yeah, you really changed my life. So by me expressing myself to the world, I changed your life. So let me keep expressing myself to the world in different type of ways. Let me express myself to the world by art. Let me express myself to the world by just acting in my personality. You feel me? It's like everybody want to be entertained. So you got to really use your gift. Like use that gift. Like master that gift. Master that gift of discernment. Master that gift of listening to music. Because when you listen to music, you pick up on messages. You get messages from different realities of life. Music don't come from this physical realm. Music comes from spiritual realms. It comes from all type of different realities. This is not the only reality we are living. So, when you are starting to love yourself or you, you just want to love yourself, start by saying no. Just take a small step. It only take one small step to love yourself. You don't got to be the perfect. You don't got to be perfect. You don't got to be like that person. You don't got to be like that person. Just be who you are. Really be who you are. Like, really be who you are and you attract people that's really for you. You attract things that you really want. You feel me? It's not about what you have. It's about what you do, what you have. Because somebody got more than you and they still doing less than you. And somebody got less than you and still doing more than you. So it's basically about just being the person you are and really being fearless when it comes to the illusion of other people's perspective on you. Everything is illusion. This whole video is illusion. Like, I'm talking to myself. I'm not talking to a camera. There's no camera right here. You got to trick your mind to thinking, like, I'm not really going through nothing. I'm just loving myself. I'm just getting to know myself. So when I feel this feeling, I'm getting to know myself. I know what makes me angry now. I know if I just be silent and just go with the flow of today, everything gonna fall into place. You gotta go with the flow. You really gotta go with the flow and change your perspective on the way you feel. Cause the way you feel is illusion. How you feel about that thing, it's an illusion. How you feel about that person is an illusion. Everything is reflecting. Everything you see is reflecting. So when you think it's a light right there, it's reflecting. The light is reflecting from inside of you. You understand? So, start to look at things different. Start to look at things like, this, this is really easy. I'm just playing with my mind. I'm tricking my mind to think it's hard, but it's really easy. I can do this. I could upload 10 videos a day if I really want to. This shit easy. This shit really easy. Like, expressing yourself is not hard. Expressing yourself is not hard. So if you're a person that's trying to love yourself, if you're a person that is it's really hard for you to uh, love yourself, just know the beginning stage is the challenge because I really want to see how far you're going to go with this. That's God. That's the universe. I really want to see how far you can go with this. I'm going to test your patience. 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 I really want to see if you really want to get to know yourself because... Half of the time, we don't be ready for that side of ourselves, Because we are not there. We, we can't say no to certain things. We can't say no to certain things. 
So you're going to go through phases where it seems like you're not going nowhere, but when you're going through those stages of you feeling like you're not going nowhere, you are growing so fast. You are growing so fast that it's like, you can't really understand what's going on because things are moving at a fast rate, at a fast frequency. So, embrace everything. Because one day you may be rich. One day you may be homeless. One day you may. It's, it's your choice. Everything is your choice. You choose who you want to be. You choose who you sit with. You choose what you eat. I'm saying, choose what you want. Don't let that thing choose you. Because when it chews you, it's going to consume you. You know what I mean? But I just had to make this video because these videos like this, like videos like this, it's going to really help people change their perspective on their self. Because our perspective on ourself, it, 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 it matters. How you view yourself matters. How the world view you, it don't matter. So if you view yourself as a dope ass person, like other people gonna see like, yeah, like I fuck with this person so heavy because they know they a dope ass person. Cause half of the time we be a we we be around people that don't see themselves as a dope ass person, even though you see it. Even though you see the potential in that person, that person still don't see the potential in themselves because it's hard for them to say no. So saying no is like, it's a big step to really loving yourself. Loving yourself don't got to be what you think it got to be. Love your, loving yourself is, is what you make it. Loving yourself is what you make it. So really look at it like this. My life is a movie. Everything I do is going to affect the people around me. So if I just be a leader to the people around me, they gonna see that and find inspiration. They gonna, it's gonna manifest to them. Like all these videos I'm making, it's gonna manifest through people. It's gonna manifest through my mom. It's gonna manifest to my sister. It's gonna manifest through my dad. And they gonna find a spark in my words and it's gonna change their perspective on their self. By me just living my life, it's going to change their perspective on their soul because I view myself as a dope-ass person. I view myself as a person that's, that's going to change the world. I view myself as a person that's already re-experiencing what I'm experiencing. Experiencing, I got to do it right this time. You feel me? So, like, I hope this video helped you. I'm going to continue to make videos like this, expressing my thoughts, expressing my mind. It's just like, I'm at the point in my life, like, Everything is moving so fast. I'm getting so many ideas that I don't I don't even know what to do with it. But to share it with y'all, if that really makes sense, you feel me? But I really started in this. I really started in here, you feel me? And it's like, <clears throat> it, it don't seem real. My life don't seem real at all. It just seemed like a fairy tale, like a Cinderella story, you feel me? I got scoliosis from sitting on this toilet for hours and days, you feel me? Like just recording reaction videos and... That that really helped me get comfortable with being uncomfortable. Because that uncomfortable feeling you are feeling is a feeling you're going to get used to feeling. When you feel uncomfortable, you're going to get used to feeling comfortable. Because that uncomfortable feeling is going to turn to that. It's going to turn to comfortable. Like, you're going to be comfortable with sitting with your emotions, your feelings. Because... It's something that's helping you get to know yourself, if that makes sense. You feel me? But I'm Macy Lucky. Hope this video helped y'all. You tell me, I'm signing out. You feel me? I'm not going